I'm gonna share with you the top five smartphone accessories for making videos on your phone. And we're starting right now. What is going on? My name is Nick. Welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you wanna learn how to grow your channel, make videos, and all types of other YouTube related stuff, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell so you don't miss anything. Okay, I have a buddy of mine that is an expert in film and video and all of that stuff. He actually worked in the film industry in Australia and he is the best source to go to to get this kind of information. So instead of me telling you the best accessories that you need for your phone, I'm gonna pass it off to Justin from Primal Video. Justin, take it away. Thanks very much for having me on the channel, Nick. I'm gonna share my top seven accessories for creating awesome videos using your iPhone or your Android device. So jumping straight into it, number one is a micro. Microphone. So with microphones, you've really got two main options. The first is a wired lapel or a lavalier microphone, something like the Boya BYM1 microphone, which sells for around the $20 US price point. It's actually what I'm using right now for this video. You can hear that tapping there now. This is plugged directly into my DSLR. So this microphone will work on both smartphones and on DSLR. So it's a pretty awesome microphone. Now, another great option would be the Rode SmartLav, which is another tiny little microphone that's designed to work with your smartphones. Or you can go something like the Rode Video Micro, which is a shotgun microphone. So the second type of microphones. So this here is a super directional microphone, meaning that it's only gonna pick up the audio in the direction that this microphone is pointing. So it's a fantastic microphone. I think these sell for around the $50 to $70 price point, but an awesome addition if you're gonna be creating videos on your phone. Number two is a tripod. Obviously to get the best footage, you want your footage to be stable and smooth. And that's where a tripod is going to come in handy. So one that I recommend is the Archon tripod and the Archon phone mount. Now you can pick these up for again, around the $20 price point. This will let you hold your phone in either portrait or in landscape mode. Um, and it is a great small light tripod that you can easily carry with you. And it's gonna give you some great stable footage for your videos. So wherever possible, get your phone out of your hands and get it stable in a tripod. And the one I recommend is the Archon tripod. And Nick will have links to everything that I'm talking about linked in the description box below. Accessory number three is a wide angle lens, which is gonna give you a more cinematic look for your videos. So this one here is a huge wide angle lens. This one is an Orky lens. They sell for around the $26, $27 mark on Amazon. Uh, this one will work on most smartphones, whether you're using the front facing camera or the rear camera on your phone, something like this should work on most devices. Now, this will let you get a lot more into your shot. If you're filming in small locations, like a small room, you wanna get multiple people in or a heap more in the background, then a wide angle lens will let you do that. But it'll also make your shots look absolutely amazing if you're filming outdoors, in really nice scenery, you'll get a heap more in and a lot more colors and light in as well. So a wide angle lens like the Orky lenses are a great addition to your smartphone filming kit. Number four is a third party or an aftermarket camera app for your device. So the one that I would recommend is Filmic Pro. Now this will work on iOS and on Android. So what this lets you do is really lock down and get a full range of controls, controls that you would normally find on your DSLR or on your video camera and have those same controls on your smartphone. So that's things like your white balance, your ISO, your shutter speed, your frame rates, and even the quality of the videos that you're recording. So if you really wanna take full control of your smartphone camera and max it out and lock everything down, then using an app like Filmic Pro is the way to do it. Accessory number five is a portable light. And the one that I'd recommend is an Aperture Amaran ALM9. Again, links are in the description. This is a tiny little light that really packs a punch. It's got a two hour battery life. You can charge it over USB. It is insanely bright. We can turn this up now like just crazy amounts of light from this tiny little thing. It's got some great mounting options because it's got a tripod thread on the bottom and it's also got the hot shoe or cold shoe mount as well. So you can put it directly onto your DSLR or you can mount it onto a tripod for using it with your smartphone. So crazy bright, great addition to your filming kit. 
Now, if you are gonna be using a light, the priority in your shot is obviously to light yourself up. So you probably don't need to max it out on crazy brightness, but just have it bright enough to light you as the subject or the talent on camera up so that you're looking good for your viewer. Then if you've got additional lights, then use those to light up your background. But something like this is awesome for making sure you're lit well on camera. Number six is actually a piece of software called Reflector. Now what Reflector lets you do is whether you're on iOS or Android and whether you're using a Mac or a PC, it'll let you mirror your phone screen to your desktop or to your laptop computer that's next to where you're filming so that you can mirror what's going on on your phone on your computer. So this is really handy if you're gonna be filming with your phone and you're gonna be filming with the rear facing camera, the primary camera, the better camera, then you can still monitor what's going on because obviously the screen's gonna be facing the opposite direction. So Reflector will let you mirror your phone screen to a computer so that you can see what's going on while you're sitting in front of the camera. So an amazing app and it sells for just under $15. Last but not least is number seven, which is a gimbal or an image stabilizer for your smartphone. The one that I recommend is the DJI Osmo Mobile. And you can pick these up for around the $300 price point. So they're not cheap, but they're absolutely amazing. If you're gonna be creating videos where you're gonna be walking around, or you want that really smooth gliding-like footage, from your phone. So as you can see, as we move this around, it holds your phone stable. So if you're walking, running, moving around, you're gonna get fantastic footage out of your device using this tool. So not a necessity for most people, but if you've got the budget and you really wanna take your video game to the next level, especially using your phone, then an Osmo Mobile is definitely worth considering. So those are my top seven accessories for creating awesome videos using your smartphone. So it was your microphone, your tripod, your wide angle lens, your aftermarket or third party camera app, a portable light, a copy of Reflector and a DJI Osmo Mobile. Thanks Nick, back to you. Justin, thank you so much for coming on, man. I really appreciate it. If you wanna learn more about Justin and his channel, Primal Video, I'm gonna put a card to him right here. Make sure that you go over there and check him out and subscribe right now because the stuff that he provides on his channel is absolutely awesome. If you're considering getting anything for your channel, he's most likely got a comparison video about it. So make sure that you go over to Justin's channel and check him out right now. And if you wanna learn how to grow your channel, make videos and all types of other YouTube related stuff, start now by hitting the round subscribe icon so you don't miss anything. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.